All right, story time. So this is a fountain pen or a nib, nib pen, I think you'd say, uh, which my friend gave me more than three years ago. So you can see all the wear and tear over here. <laughs> and it has been great. Um, it lasted for a long while and it still does. Uh, the nib is the type which you can take it off. And the thing is, I ran out of the brown ink and so I was like hmm I guess I want to have another fountain pen so uh, the actual fountain pen which you can fit up the inside I had that when I was a kid but not anymore and so I went to milligram and the lady um, uh, was there the store clerk and I asked do you have any fountain pen for illustration and she was like no uh, we don't have specifically for fountain pen but we have this and this is the kakuno pen or in Japanese pronunciation it's kakuno and this kakuno pen is um, look at that this is a cute one uh, so this kakuno pen uh, she had it and she was like, would you like to try mine? And I was like, yeah, sure. And then she let me try it. And she also dipped it in the bottle of ink for more flow. And I really love that you can dip it in the bottle of ink. And it was so smooth. And she was like, although uh, it's for writing, you can use it for illustration. And it has a nice fine line. And look at that cute face. So she had a different case. I got this purple one because I wanted to change the face. I didn't want baby blue. There was a lot of clear cases, but you know, I wanted to change of paste, so I got the violet one and it had the winky face. And so this is F, which is fine. And so I was like, sure, I have a black ink at home and so I can use it. Turns out I have no black ink. However, uh, I did buy the converter for the bottle ink, but this one comes with the cartridge, which is a um, disposal cartridge. So after that, you can just buy a bottle ink and fill up the converter with the ink. So in short, um, I was like, all right, I am going to illustrate with this. Now it turns out that there are inks that are water resistant and the inks that are not. I do watercolor painting. And after testing this out, after I've done an illustration, I find out this is not water resistant. This is truly for writing and just illustration, but not for watercolor. And so what I did is that I decided to use that to my advantage. And this is the result. <laughs> so you can see if you put water, it blends and bleeds as in it blends and you know smudges but use <laughs> use your circumstance to an advantage and I'm still coloring it I wanted to watercolor this by the way but I couldn't so I just did the water thing I'm gonna show you away so let me take a brush that's wet and you'll see what I did was this To see how you can turn it into a shadow. So yeah, that's the result. The coloring part, I'm using a basic coloring pencil, which I got as a gift from my clients actually, because they're really really nice people. Shout out to clients at Little Muslims Official. And so yeah. That's it. Looks like I am going towards coloring pencils now instead of watercolor. Um, still searching for ink. Couldn't find it. But the limitations which writing inks have has brought out a lot of advantages and positives. It's a real change <laughs> in terms of my art journey. Uh, I feel like I'm going to stick to this for a while, inshallah. But yeah, that's it. Just want to share a story. And you know, look at that face. It's so happy. It's like, wink. See? What you think as my disadvantages is actually an advantage. But yeah. Well, um, hope this was kind of helpful. <laughs>
but yeah, I just wanted to share this, like, because this is, this is, this is, I've never had this kind of experience, like, actually, um, really struggling with inks and getting the right one and then finding out I had, I ran out of my old inks. And, but yeah, this was a nice, fun thing. Um, thank you. I'm very, 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 very happy with the whole result. And so this one will have to wait for a while. I need to get a proper ink bottle after searching. I found out about Noodler's Ink, with, uh, which my art buddy told me. Um, we talk about art stuff together, but uh, when I thought I found Noodler's Ink, I couldn't find the water resistant one. Oh my goodness, I later found it's not water resistant, and so another company, <coughs> perhaps. Well, sorry if that hurt your ear. Uh, but yeah, Kakuno will be my best friend for now, and hopefully for the time being. And I can't focus. Oh well, hope you enjoyed this one, and see you guys later.